So Friday, warm up. Three rounds not for time again, okay? So just move. So I have five air squats to start and we're gonna work on tempo there. So slow it down, get in a great position for your squats. Three seconds down on your air squats and then come back up. Five spider lunge, hip circles. So get in that Spider-Man lunge, circle the hips out, five on each side. 10 giant arm circles, big swings. Okay, get your shoulders primed up, 100 meter jog, and then just five broad jumps, as far as you can jump on each one. Okay, so you're gonna go through that three times and um, then we'll move on. Okay, so our next piece is back squat. So back squat is the lift for the day. Um, goal obviously is to just get some leg stimulation. We're gonna back squat, but if you can't back squat, you don't have a bar or you know any kind of weights or that option, uh, find something you can back rack or front rack. So something you can put on your back, Again, we can go back to the dog food or front rack and um, jugs. Fill them up uh, with water as needed. Tape the top on, make sure it don't explode while you're squatting. And uh, if you're gonna change to some kind of object, right, other than the barbell and some heavier weights, you know, the back squat is a five, uh, five rep over every two minutes, so increasing the weight. If you can't do that or that's not an option, totally fine, change the rep scheme to three sets, eight to 12 reps, okay? Somewhere in there, we're looking for that stimulus. So, you know, if you get to the last set and it's, you only get eight, that's fine. We're just looking in that, that rep scheme. Um, so three sets, eight to 12 reps, rest about three minutes in between that stuff. But the, the caveat here is we're adding a tempo of three seconds down and three seconds up with a two second hold at the top. Okay, so this will get a nice stimulation for you guys you can even do these with air squats and, and it's tough, okay? So no, no uh, pause on the bottom though, right? So we're going three down, right back up, right? So three down, three up, and then hold for two at the top. Three sets, eight to 12 reps, and get at least like three minutes rest in between there. Your legs are gonna be burning, I promise you. Um, and then our wad today, five rounds for reps. Okay, if you do have a wall ball or something you can throw up in the air and catch safely without smashing your face and it has some weight to it, two minutes. So you'll do 20 wall balls. And then if you guys have a rope, 20, or excuse me, 20 wall balls and wrap of double unders in the remaining time. So if it takes you, you know, if you can do unbroken on the wall balls, that's what we're looking for. You know, somewhere between 30 to 40 seconds tops uh, no more than a minute though. Okay, so something you can do in less than a minute and then AMRAP of double unders. Then you get a minute rest and you'll repeat that for five rounds. Okay, so that is, you know, if you have a wall ball or something you can throw up and catch with some weight and you have a, a jump rope. Uh, if a dumbbell or a KB and a rope is available, okay, in two minutes, complete 20 front rack, KB or dumbbell thruster. So you guys will be here, you'll squat, you'll press, okay? And you'll do 20 reps. And then in the remaining time, again, we'll do AMRAP of jump ropes. Uh, if you guys don't have a, a dumbbell or KB or a rope, five rounds again, in two minutes, 30 air squats, and then an AMRAP of max distance brawl jumps. So jump as far as you can. Again, set up some kind of marking space outside or inside if you have a garage or even just a big kitchen. Get, get some kind of distance that you can make measurable. And as always, a minute rest after each round, okay? Uh, afterwards, three rounds for time, 10 V-ups, 10 tuck-ups, 10 hollow rocks. Um, it says for time, but if you just wanna kind of get through those, not for time, that's fine as well. So that, that is Friday's work. Any questions, let us know. Talk to you soon. Thank you.